Hello YouTube. Hello, hello. Oh, no, I'm not talking to you, sorry. No, 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 no. So a couple of weeks ago, I was out with some friends for a meal and some drinks in Windsor. Uh, after we came out of the bar, there was this beautiful, beautiful uh, silver bengal just hanging around outside. Obviously, I went to go make friends with him. But as I was there, kneeling on the cold, wet floor, I got some treats out of my bag and gave him some. And this lady comes over and asks me if I brought treats specifically for Dexter. And I had to say, no, I just happen to have treats in my bag. It was then that I realised I really am a crazy cat lady. Don't get me wrong, I've always loved cats, but getting that look from that lady, she thought it was funny rather than weird, I hope. But yeah, it just made me realise actually that's not normal to just carry cat treats around in your bag in case you happen to bump into random cats. I thought today, as well as telling you that lovely story, I would introduce you to all of my cats slash my parents' cats, because that's where I'm living at the moment. So let's go find the cats. Here's Timber. He is six years old, and his hobbies include being very fluffy and eating the heads off bunny rabbits. Delightful. Here we have Luna. She is three years old and was once bitten by a fox. She recovered very well and now just likes relaxing and sleeping on any body part that she can. This is Smokey, my granny's cat. Smokey is two years old and likes to invade privacy. She also gets so matted that she has to be shaved and ends up looking like this. It's pretty adorable, actually. Go on a hunt for more some kitty cats. Kelly! <laughs> Kelly is always here and she's not here. Callie is four years old. She likes to be very loud in the litter tray and escape out of windows. She is very partial to dreamies and milks. Here we have Rosie. She is eight years old. Her hobbies include ruling the roost and making sure you know it and sitting on shoulders. She likes to pretend to be a parrot but this does mean that you can't get anything done. Kitty is 14. A small old lady has spent many of her lives. She had cat flu, was hit by a car, spent 10 days trapped in a garage, and now she has a thyroid problem. But she is very, very cute. Here's Ziggy. Ziggy is seven. She doesn't do very much and is a little dim. She doesn't know what to do when being stroked, but she thinks she likes it. And I have absolutely no idea how she managed to get her bulk up there. Though Smokey is only visiting, the rest live here full time. Six cat is a lot, but we love them all. We've always had cats in the family, but they've only been my mum's babies since me and my brother went to uni. So we are very much a pair of crazy cat ladies. Me and G would like another cat, but not until we've moved into our own place again. So many unwanted cats in the world. It's not hard to find a rescue place which has got uh, kittens, but if you can, just adopt an old cat. Um, I'm going to leave some links in the description below of places where you can either sponsor cats or adopt cats from. Also, I have a lot of cat pictures on my phone, not just of my cat. This is my friend's cat, Percy. This is my other friend's cat, Oscar. This is a friend's cat, Tasha. This is our family friend's cat, Titan. This is a stray who lived in my in-laws garden. And as you can see from his face, a bit beaten up, but I managed to befriend him. Um, I did catch him and take him to the events, but unfortunately he died a week later. This is a random cat I saw on a walk to the post office. This is another random cat I saw. I would absolutely love to see pictures of your cats, but either share them below, or tweet them to me, uh, my Twitter link is down below. If you want to share any stories of your cats, I'd love to hear them. So yeah, please like, share, subscribe, and all that jazz. And I will see you next week. Thanks for watching, goodbye YouTube.